there are 10 apps. But, why? Trace Together app. Before entering Singapore and during your stay in Singapore, you or your family members must all download the Trace Together TT app or obtain a Trace Together token. Children under the age of 6 in the current calendar year are exempt from this requirement. The TT app is available for free download from the Apple App Store, Google Play Store, and Huawei App Gallery. Visitors from mainland China may need to use a VPN to download the app. After passing through immigration, you can activate and use the TT app for the duration of your stay in Singapore. Most venues no longer require check-in, but for larger events, with more than 500 participants at any one time and certain nightlife establishments, it requires safe entry check-in. In this cases, you can use the app to enter. The app will also notify you if you have been exposed to COVID-19 during your visit. Only delete the app 14 days after leaving Singapore. This allow Ministry of Health MOH, to inform you if you were possibly exposed to COVID-19 when you are in Singapore. Google Maps app. Google Maps is most likely the best application to download while in Singapore or any other countries. It allows you to find restaurants, hotels, bars, and venues with a single click. Not to mention the direction that it provide. With just a few clicks, it will guide you from your current location to your next destination. For example, if you are at City Hall MRT station and want to go to Marina Bay Sand MBS, with a few inputs and clicks, it will show you a few different routes that you can take, including the public transport and bus number, the walking route, and even nearby cab that you can take. Another useful feature is the ability to save locations while sitting in your hotel. These will then appear when you use your phone outside if you're logged in with a Google account. As a result, instead of spending time outside looking for new places, you can save a lot of time. Google Maps also allows you to download maps offline, so you don't have to be online to use it. This is also one of the primary advantages of using Google Maps, as you will not need to bring a physical map with you when traveling. My Transport app. This well-known Singapore app is one of the best bus apps in the city-state. It can be used to find nearby bus stops and service numbers, as well as bus route details and real-time bus arrival information. This Singapore public transportation app can also be used to locate taxi stands, get real-time parking lot availability, traffic updates, and explore cycling routes. If you find yourself in a bus stop after getting the bus number from Google Maps, you can open the app and check the arrival time, although Google Maps do have this function too. But what is good about this app is, it provides you with in-depth bus route details and bus stop number, letting you know whether the bus direction you are taking is correct. Explore Singapore MRT Map App Singapore has one of the world's best MRT systems, which is known for its cleanliness and punctuality. Not to mention that Singapore is notoriously hot, so it can be refreshing to go underground, find some shade, and cool off. When you arrive in Singapore, you should download the Explore Singapore MRT Map App. The application includes maps, prices, route planners, street maps, and time indicators, making it ideal for busy commuters who use the MRT and LRT frequently. Example, if you are at City Hall MRT and want to go to Botanic Gardens, with a few clicks, it will show you the route, number of stops and transfer, and the estimate time. The best part about using this app is that, it can be used both online and offline, which is preferable if you don't want to use roaming in areas where there is no internet. Grab App Singapore's public transportation may be efficient, but after that heavy dim sum lunch, you're just tired. This is where Grab enters the picture. As the dominant player in the Singapore ride-hailing market, you'll have no trouble finding a car at any time of day. Grab, like all other ride-hailing services, has several tiers from which to choose. They should be able to accommodate your entire party, from an economical car, to a premium six-seater vehicle. If you're traveling with a pet, there's also a Grab pet option with train drivers and pet insurance that covers the car. Grab also offer food delivery services. This can be extremely convenient because you can find restaurants within the app and then have the food delivered to your door by a driver. CDG Zig App 
If you don't prefer private hire car, a taxi or cab is your next option. This is a Singapore taxi company that combines two taxi brands, Comfort and City Cab, which have a combined fleet of over 10,000 taxis in Singapore. In Singapore, you can often flag down taxis on the street, but at peak times, this Singapore taxi app is far superior. Once log in with your mobile number, you just have to input your location and your destination. And select your preferred option with the fare indicated. After that just wait for the confirmation of the cab driver info to appear, and wait for the cab to arrive. All major credit cards, as well as Apple Pay, Samsung Pay, Android Pay, and Cash, are accepted by Comfort Delgro Taxis. Chope App Chope, which was founded in 2011, is a restaurant booking app that allows you to search for restaurants based on cuisine type, availability, date, and location. And with a single click, you can reserve a table. Chope charges restaurants for using its table booking system, but does not charge users. Chope offers deals, guides, event information, and much more, in addition to restaurant booking services. Simply visit their website if you want to learn more. Visit Singapore App Visit Singapore is a popular travel guide app that has grown in popularity over the years. It provides maps, guides, and directions to help you navigate the city. Whatever your interests and preferences are, there are numerous activities and tours available. By clicking on one of the precinct guides, for example, you can see all of the popular attractions that are worth visiting. Visit Singapore keeps you up to date on all the latest news and events, such as music festivals, sporting events, restaurant deals, recommended bars, and what you can see and do. And information about transportation and how to get around. You can also get essentials information during your stay in Singapore, like the currency rate, location of money changers, and useful contacts in case of emergency. My ENV app. The My ENV app is a one-stop mobile platform for a range of information. From the weather, air quality, drain water levels and floods, to water service disruptions, and where to find hawker centers and more. For tourists, the best function is probably to stay updated on the weather in Singapore. Depending on the months, it can rain a lot throughout the city. If Sentosa Island is your destination on that day, having a good weather is a must. So checking the weather forecast beforehand can not only prevent you been soaked in the rain, but spent a quality time in an indoor attraction. So, you should probably check the weather forecast first to avoid getting soaked. Your activities must be planned in accordance with the weather forecast. If it starts to rain, it's probably best to spend a couple of hours inside a bar or museum. iChang'e app The iChang'e app is probably another useful travel app that travelers will love. As its name suggests, this travel app will help you get around Chang'e Airport. Different from other travel apps, iChang'e has the ability to keep an eye on your flight status as well. Furthermore, you can also use this travel app to look up options for entertainment, shopping, and restaurants. It even has a pre-order currency exchange function, where you can go through the live rate, select your currencies, choose collection date and time, review your order, and proceed to make payment. When it's time to collect your currencies, go to Terminal 1 and 3 at Changi Airport. Thank you for watching, if you like the video, please click and subscribe, and comment below.